play a game called 10 to 1 Dating where I help a lucky lady find love. But today, in a special Halloween edition, I'm gonna help a princess find her match. And this is 7 to 1 Dating. All right, so we got our seven dwarfs here. We got them. Thanks for coming, fellas. But now... Well, who's gonna be our Snow White? You might recognize her as a girl who played the ultimate trick on the newlywed couple when she crashed their wedding. Take a look. Carly, what, why'd you crash their wedding? It was just like an impulse decision. I drove by, saw there was a bunch of cars, and I was like, I was like, all right, there's a wedding going on? <laughs> just, just met this boy the other day. I was like, hey, you wanna go on a date? He's like, sure. I'm like, you wanna crash a wedding? <laughs> He's like, even better. Yeah. <laughs> okay, you're not dating the guy anymore, right? That was our first date. First and only date. Yeah. You will allow Uncle Steve to do this for you. I would love to bring you right back here and let you pick from just a plethora of men and send you out on a fabulous date. <laughs> a fabulous date. Well, please welcome the wedding crasher herself. Here's Carly. Hi, Hi. Hi Carly. Hi. Hi, darling. <laughs> How are you? <laughs> so, Carly, you been, have you been asked out on a few dates since uh, since your story went viral? Quite a few, yeah. Mostly Facebook messages, though. A little creepy. I saw you on the Steve Harvey show. You crashed in a wedding. Oh, okay. Yeah, yep. All right, well, <laughs> I did what I said I was going to do, and this is how this yes. is going to work. Now, the dwarfs have already given us uh, answers to the questions that I'm about to ask Snow White. So, dwarfs, if your answers uh, match up with Snow White, uh, then you get to stay. <laughs> if Snow White doesn't like your answer, then it's... Hi ho, hi ho. Bye. Off the set you go. <laughs> and then the dwarf standing at the end wins the date. All right, so here we go. First question. When it comes to spontaneity, are you into guys who plays it by the rules, or would you rather date the guy who is willing to crash a wedding? Obviously crash the wedding. If you're not crashing a wedding, <laughs> goodbye. Well... <laughs> Number two, uh, you didn't pass the test. That means you're it's out. crazy, man. <clears throat> Bye, number two. <laughs> I don't know if you got to save, but you know what to do. I'll see you in a little bit. <laughs> yeah, yeah, was that grumpy there? Because he was pissed. Seemed, seemed like grumpy. Yeah. Next question, when it comes to your man's social media, are you into the guy who tries to get as many likes as he, as he can get, or should he think who needs social media when I got you. Oh, obviously, when they have me. When Who needs I got social you. Media? <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> well, that means the guy that's into uh, social media Ooh, that that's... is out. Number three, that's you. Two and three. <laughs> yeah, two and three, right See out. See you later. Uh, next question. <laughs> We're going through this kind of quick. It's uh, Friday night. Is your man dancing on the tables or keeping a low profile? Mm. I would say dancing on the tables. You gotta be dancing on the tables. <laughs> Number four, no! I see him, he's sad. That means the guys who like to keep a low profile can go. Number seven and number four, that's you. Oh, oh no. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, are they trying to... So, you know what, Steve? You're not the only guy that rocks a mustache, so uh, oh. tell her what she's missing. Yeah, I yeah. will. I'll yeah. tell her. <laughs> We only got one left with a mustache. Yeah, you're missing a mustache. I got, I got yours right here. We're good. Well, we've just eliminated four <laughs> bachelors. Uh, which dwarf is gonna be Snow White's favorite? We're gonna find out when we come back. Carly, you now have the opportunity to ask each one of them a final question. These are the finalists, and you get to ask the questions of each one. Let's start with number one. Number one, all right. I crashed a wedding. What is the craziest thing you've ever done? Um, I actually crashed a wedding when I was 16. Oh, I'm behind yeah. then. <laughs> Sorry about that. Yeah. Slightly behind. Yeah, you're Nothing a to behind. top the wedding crashing, though? What's Did I that? peak? Nothing to crash the wedding topping? 
Mm. Uh, crashing. Something crazy that I've done? Yes. I saved somebody's life on a first date that I met off of Tinder. He saved somebody's <laughs> life. What did you do, man? Yeah, what happened? If you want to know how, you got to wait for the date. Oh, OK, OK. My oh, man, I like that, boy. Now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I like that, a little cliffhanger. Yeah. Yeah, this is next season of Game of Thrones. Yeah. That's it. All right, uh, number five, you're next. Carly, what's your question? All right. Besides today, <laughs> what's the most embarrassing thing you've dressed up as? Well, uh, it was two years ago, back home, back east, me and all my buddies dressed up as nuns and ran around the city of Boston. <laughs> was it Halloween? <laughs> what? <laughs> or is it just random? <laughs> it, was, it was Halloween. Not but we probably would have done that. Slightly crazy. Not too we probably would have done that on any other given night. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. A nun. God, dog, dude. All right, number six, your turn. <laughs> Ask away. All right. Where do you see yourself in five years? Uh, five years, walking down the aisle right next to you. Now, that's the type of line you want. <laughs> oh, it ain't true. <laughs> but, to, but to say that, that's, I like that. So Carly, it's time to choose. <laughs> I just want to go. Oh, they want you. All right, we're going to go by round of applause. Yes, there Number we go. one. Oh, yikes, number one. Number five. <laughs> Number six. Thank you, thank you. Well, I think she wants to date you. <laughs> okay, who's it gonna be, Carly? I think we have to go with number five. The number honor. five, come on over. <laughs> come on over, buddy. <laughs> All right, one and six, great job. All right, I'm sending the two of you out on a date right now. I want Wait, you to come back you. tomorrow and tell us how it went and let us know if there's gonna be a second date or not. Mm. That sound good? Have a nice time. Sounds beautiful. All right. Nice okay. guy, though. I think he's a nice guy. <laughs> Thanks for being here. We'll see you tomorrow. We'll be right back. Hey, you made it to the end of this video. I got a lot more that you're going to enjoy, so just click to watch the next one. And make sure you subscribe to always know what's happening.